I went to Paris to meet football legends, attend the Champions League final, and play on the actual Champions League final pitch. This is by far my craziest video ever. To get things started, we had to fly from Cincinnati to Paris. Let's go, we made it to France. Look at the view from the hotel. Oh my God. I can't believe this is my view for the next five, five days. So for our first two days, we arrived at the PlayStation house where we would meet footballers, YouTubers, and more. Well, first I found out I was playing FIFA against Rio Ferdinand. PlayStation house, taking on Rio Ferdinand. You guys are coming with me. We filmed for PlayStation, EA Sports, and Bleach Report. So they had to do my makeup. I I've never had my makeup done before. All right, we're about to interview Rio Ferdinand. This is, this is Gwen. How do I look? Do I look all right? Do I look good? Gwen? Yeah, it's hard making this face look good sometimes. Before we record with Rio, though, here's the setup that they had us playing in. Okay, we're about to play Rio Ferdinand and <laughs> FIFA. Look at the setup. Follow me. Where we'll be playing? I think I'm controlling Real Madrid and Rio will be... No, I'm Liverpool. Real's Real Madrid. This is the actual player of the month trophy that will be given out. I'm holding it now. Salah will be holding it on Saturday. You will know who's holding it when you're watching this video because, well... Yeah, the game will be over. Hopefully Sal is holding this nope. after me. And then this is it. Hopefully Sal will be holding both of these. This is the actual trophy. This is the actual trophy that they will be holding. Don't want to touch. I feel like I'm not I'm not touching it. I'm not. Look at it. Come here. You can see a reflection on the camera. Amazing. Okay, right. I gotta prep because we're about to beat Rio Ferdinand and FIFA. Jake, yes. So we played a full match. Rio actually ended up beating me. 1-0. He scored in the 118th minute to win it. After that, we had loads of other activities throughout the house, so. May as well give you a tour of it, right? I'm gonna give you the full tour of everything. All right, so behind me, we have tech ball, which I will not be playing because you do not want to see that. We got a little 1v1 course right here where in a little bit, you will be seeing me play one of the best street footballers in the world. We'll have to see how that goes. It's not gonna be good. That is equivalent to my skill level right there. We got the balls. We got the official kit. We got food. I don't know what this is, but Pretty good. I have no idea what it is. Who will win? You guys already know my prediction. Liverpool. Boom. All right, this is the live stream room. We will be live streaming in here at some point. All right, so this is the room. We got FIFA over here. We got foosball. We got basketball. We are going to be playing one of the best female footballers in the world in basketball a little bit later. Here we go. I'm not good at football, but I'm good at basketball. All right, that's it for the house tour. We have football with one of the best street footballers in the world, Roberto Carlos, Makalele, stay tuned. Next footballer that we would meet was Jordan Haitama. All right, I'm here with Jordan. One of the best women footballers in the world who plays for Canada in PSG. A challenger to a 1v1 basketball game. No! <laughs> great, great, great match. Um, what was that final score? Jordan, thank you so much. Or yes, uh, she beat me. We both attempted to predict that the Champions League final winner where yeah, she beat me there too. We then played a match of FIFA where every time goals were scored, confetti was shut off. And I didn't know this, and I swear I almost died after I scored my first goal. Oh, oh walk it in. Yes! Oh my God! Yes! Other footballers that were in the building included Roberto Carlos, Patrice Evra, and Claude Macalelli, but you'll see them in a future video. There were loads of football challenges to compete in outside, so I pulled one of my friends to the side. I don't know if you know him. He goes by the name of Street Panna. He's one of the best street footballers in the world. So I challenged him to a 1v1 match. All right, here we go. We have Jack from Street hey, Panna. We're here. It's a pleasure, bro. One of the best street footballers in the world. And he's about to destroy me. Hey, I've heard this is going to be a challenge. I know it's going to be. Nah, I know not. it's. It's not. But what we're going to do, first of three goals. First of three? Okay. Normally, a panna, a nutmeg is a knockout. For you, I'm going to just say it's a point. So if I, right. if I get a nutmeg, one point, well, first of three. Yeah. Ready, go. Oh, he's quick. Oh, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> You gotta take the jacket off. Oh, it's serious. Are you sure? <laughs> oh my god. Are you sure? Yeah, no. Yeah, oh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Is that good? Let's go. 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 Here we go. Nice try. Doing, I'm doing. He could, he could be playing so much better. Is the thing. Hey, you're doing well. You're doing well. There you go. Whoa. I'm so yep.
dropped this man a sub. I'm happy I just scored one goal. <laughs> Legend. After I then got to meet one of the best football creators. All right, we got Thog there. So if we're getting him on the video, we need a prediction. So my prediction, 2-1 Real Madrid. 2-1 Real Madrid. Okay, I'm 3-2 Liverpool. It either goes 0-0 extra time 1-0 or 1-0 or it just goes goal crazy. And like this video, how many likes are we going for on this video? Fun. Dude, this is a crazy video. 100,000 likes. 100,000 likes. Yeah, we can hit 100,000. I've never Easy. done it, but we can hit 100,000. Easy. 100%. Walk in the park. 100K likes. You heard it here from Thogden. Let's go. Let's go. We left the PlayStation house and I went to meet up with another YouTuber. You may know him. See? Foot Crunch. We both wanted to make a bet on this game, so we chose our sides. Liverpool Madrid. I'm, I'm backing Liverpool fully. Let's make yeah. a bet, all right? You yeah. down? Yeah, like, I'm down. Like big money. I, okay, depends right. how big. A thousand dollars, me and you. Liverpool wins, you give me a thousand. Real Madrid wins, I give you a thousand. All right. A thousand dollars in Madrid wins. I mean, I'm sure we're gonna win. I'm just gonna take Game it. Game on, let's go. <laughs> but after that, it was time to go home and rest up because the next day was the Champions League final. Before I show you what happened during the final, I need to preface things by saying thank you. This is the million subscribers special. And what happened during the final, easily one of the best days of my life. And I wouldn't have happened without you guys. You guys got me here to a million subs. I, I love you guys so much. Anyone who's watched one of my videos, you guys are amazing. Let's get into this. Right, we made it. Champions League final, Stade de France. Little blue carpet, welcome party, dirty mic. That was smooth, man. It's a good intro. Let's go, we're here. Before I we went into the match, I met some more icons. Robert Pires being one of them, a French legend. The VIP area we in was incredible. Free food, drinks, celebrities were everywhere, footballers. It was then time to go into the match. We fought through the crowd, but finally made it in. And as soon as I walked into the stadium and saw it for the first time, man, it was honestly one of the most incredible moments I've ever experienced. Ticket, we are officially going in to the Champions League final. All right, boys, we're in. Final, let's go. I can't believe it, we're here. We're in the lower level. These seats are gonna be, might be the best seats I've ever sat in. This is my first ever European football match. and we had the most incredible seats. Six rows back from the pitch. We were in front of celebrities such as Will Ferrell, wow. Owen Wilson. In the first half, there were loads of chances from Liverpool, but Courtois was saving everything. There was a controversial VAR decision that went down and we couldn't see what was happening on the pitch. First half ended and things were still nil-nil. All right, we got, we got thugged in here. Yeah, what are we people. saying? It's so evil. So first, first goal, first goal wins. Yeah. You see that? Down to the second half where finally, a goal was scored by none other than Vinicius Jr. Real Madrid fans were going absolutely crazy after Courtois made save after save after save. Final whistle blew, Real Madrid 1-0. I lost a thousand dollars and was not happy. It was amazing to see the players celebrate right in front of us. I feel like I could have reached out and touched them. The match is just ending. They're literally right there celebrating. I may have lost a thousand dollars. It's all right. Marcelo, Benzema, Madrid. They're all right there celebrating. 
Trophy was raised. Even though I lost my prediction, I wasn't mad. This day was incredible. That's a wrap. That's it. Final over. Madrid is celebrating right there. Thank you for subscribing. One million subscribers. That's it. That's the video.